Did you actually go and trick or treating? Yeah, of course. Isn't Halloween canceled this year? Uh, why would it be canceled? Because of Corona? What's Corona? Are you okay? Have you been living under a rock? No, I, I live in this house. Right. Oh, candy's not gonna eat itself. Did you hear anything I just said? There's not even gonna be any kids out there. You have no idea how hard it was to get here. You couldn't see a thing out of this. Wait, who are you? It is I, Skip McCloudy. Skip who? You know, Skip McCloudy, episode 1013, right here. Nope, nothing, doesn't ring a bell. This is embarrassing, but... Uh, what, what do you want? Well, Lucas... I'm here for your job! I want to prove that I am more trusty than you. So you're not here to kill me? Uh, what? No. So what's the whole ghost costume for? Uh, you, you just happened to catch me while I was trick-or-treating. How are you gonna prove you're more trusty than me? Well, I'll tell you, Lucas. I challenge you to a weather off. A what? A weather off. A weather off? A weather off. This is stupid. Hey, where are you going? I'm going home. Get back here! 
How was it? Yeah. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bells swing and jingle bells ring. Snowing and blowing a bushels of fun. Now the jingle hop has begun. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Yo, Lucas. Oh, hey, hey, man. I'm, it's your um, somewhat trusty weatherman. Yeah, it's me, Brayden. Yeah. Uh, 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 I know you're probably busy, like, out, like, studying the weather or, or whatever you do. But, like, I mean, it's Christmas time. If you want to hang out or something, just let me know. Okay, uh, I think that's all I have to say. Goodbye, man. I got pee. Santa?
Where are we? We're here. Hello, ma'am. I would like a Big Mac and a, a Big Mac meal, please. And a, what do you want? What well, Sprite could be my meal, sir? Uh, Sprite, please. Oh, can I go? Shut up! I didn't have a fillet. Have? I had a number nine meal. Two cheeseburger meal. Thank you so much. And a Sprite. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Can you take me home? No. Please. No. Who even are you? I'm Skip McCloudy. Skip who? I was literally in like so many episodes already. Like like four. Like three or four. I do not know me. Episodes of what? I got you McDonald's. You know this guy? Yeah, we've had a run-in before. You're right. I already informed your somewhat trusty weatherman. But my name is Skip McCloudy. Why do you look so nonplussed? I'm literally like Lucas's arch nemesis. He's not my arch nemesis. What, what is going That's on? There's no McDonald's for a whole week. That was like super mean. We're gonna be here for a week? Well, at least until the special's over. What, what, what special? Well, I was thinking we could, I don't know, collab on a, on a Christmas special, maybe? You know, festive, and I mean, look, the you see the suit, you know, and Santa Claus, and snow, and... So, you abducted us, handcuffed us, brought us out to this barn in the middle of nowhere, and now you're asking us to do a holiday special with you. Yeah. Yes. No. Really? Yeah, if that's what it takes to get out of here. Really? Oh, that's amazing. In, in, in light of these amazing circumstances, you know, I'm gonna be right back with some more McDonald's. You stay right there. Yeah, my hair's in my eyes too. Can you help us? All right, guys. How much longer do you think this rain's gonna last for? Probably for another three hours. 
You know what cloud that is right there? That cloud tells me what the weather is going to be like for the next five days. You know, they call me the trusty weatherman. I see your umbrella has a little tear in it. You know, you might consider investing in one of these bad boys. See, this is a Cloud9 G748, top of the line. I just bought it from the umbrella shop. Look at this design. I mean, you can't go wrong with this. Truly a beautiful, a beautiful piece. Yeah, I guess I'll consider that. Hey, do you want this cool bread tie? If you ever want to tie some bread or something, you can, you can use that. And you can think of me when you're tying it also. Some pretty bad weather for Valentine's Day. Hello, Lakeside High School. It is me, Skip McCloudy, here in the holiest of holy lands to find your spouse's favorite Valentine's Day gift. First off, we have these beautiful fake flowers. Nothing like silicon to fill the lungs in the morning, you know? Any husband, wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, not anything else, or no, what? You know this next, next, you know this next thing on the list is something I think is crucial to any healthy relationship. The bucket. Next, we have Valentine's Day's probably most popular item, the beautiful, delicious Valentine's Day chocolate. <sighs> and next up, we have everyone's favorite Valentine's Day gift, the stuffed animal. Anyway. Come on, Hannah. Dude, what? She gave me this. What are you doing? Put my Pikachu away. You don't have any right to yell at me what, like that, what, man. What? Hey, get out of my face, man. <laughs> hey, Snookums. It's been a while since I've talked to you. No, this isn't about those two dudes in the chairs. I got you, McDonald's. Just because that came off our property doesn't mean I didn't. Hey! I'm sorry, I, told, I promised I wouldn't yell. Please, just give me one more chance. I need you. Yeah. Yeah.
Man, long time no see. What you doing? You want to catch up? No, I, I got I got a few um I got a funeral to go to. Yeah, yeah. My my brother died. You don't have a brother. What did I do? Did did I mess up? Are are you all right? You're kidding, right? You you abducted me, and not once but twice. And you want to be friends after that? But, but I got you McDonald's. You Lucas too. You know how much that costs every day? Like a lot. Like three meals every three meals every day. You're unbelievable. Why do you think that conversation went the way it did? Because obviously his taste in cuisine is awful. McDonald's is freaking awesome. That's one opinion, but do you think it perhaps relates back to the kidnappings earlier? Mm, yeah, I think it could be, but I think it's the food thing. And you still haven't apologized? No. What about Luna? What about Luna? Didn't you say sorry to her? Hey, Snookums. It's been a while since I've talked to you. Please, just give me one more chance. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. If you're willing to apologize to her, don't you think you could do the same for Lucas and Brayden? Why is my girlfriend in your house? Ex-girlfriend? Why are you being so mean to me? I thought we were friends. You keep doing this. It might be because you abducted me. Just maybe. I thought we were past that, man. I don't know if I can get past that. It was interesting. Uh, where 
here's the umbrella. Sir, we have a few questions about the disappearance of an umbrella. We're going to need to search this place. Uh, unfortunately, this room, we think the umbrella's in here. Is this for the weather? Or what, what's going on here? Don't play with me. We're here for the umbrella. You okay, Lucas? Are you getting enough sleep? I'm fine. Brayden! I don't think it's here. Where is it? Where's what? The umbrella. The we umbrella. know it's here. It is here. The umbrella? Okay, first of all, I don't appreciate your tone. Second of all, I think I saw Sully with an umbrella the other day. questions for you. Where is it? What? What? Do you know what we're talking about? The umbrella? No, I don't. Search the place. Sit. What do you want? The umbrella. Where is it? Mr. Beddingfield told us you have it. We were just there. What umbrella? The umbrella. What umbrella? We searched this place thoroughly. Check all the drawers. I think I've flicked everywhere. Where is it? I don't know! That sounds like something Ethan might have. Yellow? Do you have my umbrella? I, I sense it. You have it. Oh yeah, Skip has it. It's Skip. Skip! Yo, that was awesome. Do you know the power that holds? What are you doing with it open? Skip, you crossed the line. You can't just have both of the things I love, Lucas! What the heck, man? What are you doing? This is my umbrella. It has my name carved right here. I got it from the umbrella shop. Looks like, Lucas, I've got you in a bit of a check. You're gonna have to choose, buddy, between your precious umbrella and your girlfriend. What's wrong with you? 
What's wrong with you? Stinky. Where'd he go? He couldn't have gone far. I don't see him. <laughs> it's finally mine. Oh. Come on, Brayden. Yo, come on, man. Get Mickey D's. Come on. Uh, let's. You, you want to go? I, I, my car. I, you, you brought your car, right? Run. Are you all right? What, what happened here? Where's Skip? He got away. Where'd he go? Can you point to where he went? Oh no. Where is it? What? The umbrella? Brayden has it. Brayden would never take my umbrella. Did you lose it? Uh, yeah, I lost it. Oh, wait, weren't, weren't you not? This will do. It hurts, doesn't it? What do you mean? Oh, just nobody believing you? That that kind of stings. Wh wh what are you? 
I can give you anything you want. All you gotta do is give me a shake. <laughs> Are you sure we're at the right place? That's what the invitation said. Where are the other cars? What's going on, guys? I'm glad you could make it. Go on it, go on, go on. Choo choo. Chugga 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 chugga. Choo choo. Chugga 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 chugga. Choo choo. Chugga 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 chugga. Choo choo. Hey, uh, sorry about last time when I tied you up and kind of screamed in your face. It wasn't personal. Oh, oh don't worry about it. It, ha it happens all the time. Uh, actually, I, I keep the stuff. Uh, if you're hungry, we have goldfish, Cheez-Its, uh, meatball subs, and if you're thirsty, we have Hawaiian punch and high C orange. So, uh, where's everyone else? Uh, nobody else is coming. Uh, is, is that a problem? No, not a problem at all. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> well, this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> A3. Miss. Uh, B1. Okay. Let's go! Choo choo! <laughs> skip. You don't get to skip in Battleship. Skip McCloudy. I just saw Skip McCloudy. Are you sure? 100% that was Skip. It could be anybody. No, he was wearing the same same costume. Well, and that white sheet. A lot of people have white sheets, Lucas. Well, people with white sheets don't always stare through people's windows like that. Well, I have a white sheet and I stare through people's windows. Chugga 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 Choo choo What's up guys? I brought some Oh Hi you Stop already! Tired. I'm getting tired of this too. Where's my umbrella, Skip? I already told you. I don't have it. Brayden does. Why would Brayden take my umbrella? He's a weatherman just like me. And this act you're pulling off, the, the ghost costume act, the same one that you did last year, what's up with that? Wait, what? what? You were just out there. I saw you from inside the house. That wasn't me. Who was that then? Hello there, trusty weatherman Lucas. Do I know you? I sure hope so. I seem to know you. Listen, some traveler handed me this map, said if I followed it, I find the most powerful umbrella ever created. <laughs> Are you a cowboy? Is it not obvious? 
Well, I don't have my umbrella because this guy took it and won't give it back. I already told you, I don't have it. Brayden does! And who are you? Well, my name is Billy Bo Bonds. Junior. The, the third. <clears throat> right. Okay. Where's my umbrella? I already told you, Brayden has it. He would not do that to me. Well, I think it's time you stop blaming me. How could I not after everything you've done to me? I just want to make a holiday special with you. Also, don't forget, I got you McDonald's. If anything, you're in the wrong. You took my girlfriend. She broke up with you. You idiot. Being a very bad friend, Lucas. <laughs> See you later, loser. You know what his umbrella is anyways? I I don't know. Why do you want it so much? I have my reasons. Well, I better hurry on then. Was that a cowboy? I don't know. What did he want? Definitely the umbrella. So, what are you gonna do? I think I need to talk to Brayden. You know what his umbrella is? Show me. This is it. This is the last place I saw the umbrella. Someone's been here recently. That was really gross. I picked up a train. what you want. I guess now is not a good time to tell you that you're being followed. Skip, are you coming? Right here. Alright, we're here. So, this is where the umbrella is? I sure hope so. I should warn you, don't touch the umbrella. If you do, it'll connect to you and it will tear your life apart. Only a weatherman can touch the umbrella. So, how are we gonna get it? I guess it's time to acknowledge the corn. What, what does that even mean? It's a cowboy saying, I, no, actually, yeah, you're, you're a cowboy. I used to be a weatherman.
What? Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. No, no, no. I was the weatherman before Lucas. What happened? No need to yawn that hours away, okay? We need to stick to the task at hand. I came up with a plan. Me and Jerome. Wait, we're gonna... wait, wait, wait. Who is Jerome? My horse. Anyways, me and Jerome, we're gonna. Is that the umbrella? Obviously. You know who this is? Yeah, he's my friend. Billy Bo Barnes Jr. the third. Yeah, he used to be a trusty weatherman. Oh, is, is that what he told you? I guess he forgot to mention that uh, he got kicked off the Council of Weathermen. Isn't that right? Wait. So there's a council of weathermen? Oh yeah. They created the umbrella, they choose who's worthy of wielding the umbrella, and um, I guess they chose me. You are not worthy of that umbrella. You betrayed everyone. Um, yeah, your opinion doesn't matter, and um, you're not on the council anymore. He kind of got you there. So here's what's gonna happen. I'll be right back. You know, this whole kidnapping thing is so weird, like the other way around. Hey. Hey. Uh, uh, listen, I need to talk to you about something. Um, now's not really a good time. Uh, it's pretty urgent. Can I, can I talk to you inside? Yeah, yeah, sure, come on. When you pine for the sunshine of a friendly day Met a man who lives in Tennessee, and he was the head and four. Can you stop that? Do you have anything better for me to do? That's what I thought. Skip says that you took my umbrella. <laughs> you really believe that guy? I don't really know what to believe anymore. Listen, man, we're, we're friends. I wouldn't do that to you. I mean, ever since that fight in the woods with Skip, you've acted like we don't know each other. I, uh, I, I wish I could help you, man. But I don't have it. I tried to warn you. Why would you ever trust a guy dressed up as a cowboy? And, and now that you have, look at where that ended you up. Uh, Billy, can I get some help? Looks like you're a hair in the butter, my friend. What on earth does that mean? You're in a sticky situation. I'd love to help you, but, well, my hands are tied. They're literally not! You suck! Billy! 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 Billy Bo Barnes! Billy Bo Barnes Jr. the third! Billy Bo!
Must be the dog. I didn't win. I'm, I'm just tired. Oh my lord. Billy Bo Barnes Jr. the third. It is by demand of the Weatherman Council that you drop the umbrella that you are holding, for it is a violation of the ban imposed on you. <laughs> Who are these people? They're the heads of the Weatherman Council. Put down the umbrella, or face the consequences. Sorry for accusing you. I, I now should never believe, Skip. Billy, you know that you're no longer in the with He's crazy. And we'll never know when the strike next. So. Was Skip in your basement? See what happens when you trust me. Of a white Christmas, just like the ones I used to know. Hello, I'm Skip McCloudy, and today is a very special day. It's Valentine's Day, and everyone is falling in love, especially me. I'm here today with the most beautiful person in the world for your future trusty weatherman, Rebecca. Do I see a future with Rebecca? Absolutely! We've been dating for a, a month and three days. It's been great! I swear, I am the luckiest man in the world. Becca, you're so freaking hot. You're on a break. It even makes me glad that Luna decided to break up with me. Now, all great women deserve to be treated to an even greater meal. And that's why there is no better place to take your Valentine's Day date than McDonald's. Hello. 
cool. What about Luna? Why are you so stupid? Why would you kidnap two people? That's against the law. You woke up on the wrong side of the bed. You're an idiot. Are you even paying attention? Now if I ate this, would I cry? Or would it taste like an apple? This is what I'm talking about. I don't think I can handle you anymore. I'm leaving. And you look ridiculous. Are you even paying attention? Why are you so stupid? Why would you kidnap two people? You're on the wrong side of the bed. You're an idiot. I don't think I can handle you. Why are you so stupid? And you, you look ridiculous. Just my film crew. He's getting a video of me and Rebecca's Valentine's Day dinner date. Who's Rebecca? She's right here. Obviously. I'm gonna have to take that bill away from you. Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, her name is Rebecca. Second of all, no! Nah. That umbrella doesn't belong to you, Skip. Skip. Skip? can have everything you've ever wanted and live happily ever after? You guys have called me idiot and stupid and big dumb idiot. Guess what? I've got a name for you guys. You guys are big meanie heads. Lucas, what's going on, man? Glad you can make it to this straight fire party. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, uh, is Skip here? No, he's not here yet, no. Cool. Why are you wearing your Halloween costume? What costume? This isn't a costume. Wait, you're not gonna st stay for the party? There's, there's this guy here, and he's looking for you. What? Chugga, 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 Well, there he is. Well, hello there, trusty weatherman. What do you want, Billy? What? Didn't you just call me? No, I did. Do I know you? Of course you do. I'm the Orange Weatherman. I have a message from the Council of Weathermen. Is that your real name? You haven't been in possession of the Umbrella in over a year. Because of that, a great war of the Unweatherman is going to occur. It's going to happen at this party in about... Two hours. What? Alright, so that leaves you with two options. Either you get the umbrella back from Skip and become the trusty weatherman, but you live in fear of it being stolen, or you destroy the umbrella and you lose your trusty weatherman name, and you'd go back to being a regular man. Why would I want to do that? Look at all the destructions the umbrellas brought to your life. You've lost Luna, Brayden, Skip. Uh, actually, you never really had Skip. I'm, I'm nothing without my umbrella. Are you trusty umbrella, Lucas?
Chug, 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 chug. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, Sully. It's good, it's good to, to see you. Good to see you too, yeah. Hey, Skip. <laughs> this calls for some crayons. <laughs> Skip, right now, we need that umbrella more than ever. Rebecca! What? Her name is Rebecca! Skip, if you don't hand over that umbrella right now, something very bad is going to happen. I've had enough of your games, Lucas! I just came to my boy Sully's fire party to have fire time with my fire... Girlfriend. Thanks, man. The umbrella's power is taken over. And you. You just made me believe we were friends. You're just as good as the rest of them. I suppose now is when you guys chase me? Skip, don't make us do this. Come on. Brayden, I don't think you understand. We need that umbrella now more than ever. Give me back, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, Jerome, why'd you have to go and run? Look at you now. What's he crying about? I don't know. His horse or something. It's not enough. <sighs> There's a weatherman war that is about to start, and the only way we can stop it is, is with that umbrella right there. <laughs> Looks like the war has already begun. Brayden! That's for Jerome! See you later, trusty brother man.
stop, stop, stop. I stop fighting. He, he started it. I mean, look at us. We've all turned on each other. We, we look like idiots right now. How are you dry? It's the hat. <clears throat> we have one common enemy here. I don't know if you guys understand, but this is our last shot to get this umbrella. And I, I really can't do it alone. I know, you, I know you guys hate each other, but if we don't come together right now, everything we've done would have been for nothing. I'd rather Jerome's dead. Be a no one. That it meant something. Truth. Go get this umbrella. What are you guys gonna do? You can't stop me! It's the end of the line, Brayden. Give up. I have the umbrella! This is getting out of hand, Lucas. What are you gonna do? You and your purple umbrella? Where'd you even get that? No! You suck! Good stuff, Skip. He left it behind. Right? Talk to me, man. Something. I can hear him. He's calling me. He's calling.
Listen, Skip. I, I've been an idiot lately. I, I haven't seen the truth fully, and if I'm being completely honest, what I saw out there today was more trusty weatherman than I've ever been. So, I, I wanted to give this to you. <laughs> I love you too, son. <laughs> well done, brother. You destroyed the umbrella and prevented the war from happening. We just threw it into the woods over there. As I said before, you're not trusty umbrella, Lucas. In fact, that umbrella held no power at all. Anyone could be a trusty weatherman. In order for something to be special, you just gotta believe it's special. Is somebody hungry? <sighs> What's this? I'm done. Why? Have you not been watching the specials? What specials? Never mind. It's it's a long story, but I think it's time. Well, Lucas, I guess I can't talk you out of it. Thank you for your service. It's truly been an honor. It's been a pleasure. You were the best of us. Do you know where I can find Skip McCloudy? How did you get in my house? You're not an easy man to find, Skip. What do you mean? My name is on the mailbox. I need your help. I'm not here to fight you, Skip. I just need you to answer some questions. Where did you- You knew my father, Skip. You were there when he died. Billy, 
Bell Barnes. The third? He was your father? Yes. I need your help finding his murderer. He was under the power of the Umbrella. It, it wasn't him who killed- You know who it was! Tell me where I can find him. You think I didn't prepare for this day? Not even the Council of Weathermen could stop me. This is all I have left of him. What? You really want to protect the man that murdered him? What is he doing in that picture? Can't you tell? This is him and his horse, Jerome! I know how to make you talk. I know you love this... thing. Wait. I'll give you one more chance. Wait! Only Lucas knows where he is. Lucas. Someone's coming for you. She's... she's looking for Brayden. It's... it's Billy's daughter. Trusty weatherman, Lucas. Ex-weatherman, what up? What happened to you? I believe you knew my father. Billy Bo Barnes the third. I know why you're here. Will you tell me where he is? For a price. What do you want? That umbrella. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm serious. You think I'm stupid? I know why you're an ex-weatherman. You chose to give up the umbrella. I made a mistake. I'm not special anymore. I'm a nobody. With no one who cares about me. I just want to be important. Take it. I don't want this stupid thing. Just tell me who murdered my father. Here, I thought you were actually serious about how you were feeling. <laughs> Maybe you were. You know nothing about me. Famous weatherman. Everyone knows you, Lucas. The biggest failure to the weatherman council. Shut up. You're protecting a murderer. The umbrella took him over. Umbrellas can't do that! <sighs> you... You are a stupid fucking dummy person! I know you can't use the umbrella. I saw you try. Tell me where he is. Or he dies. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa there. Whoa. That's not necessary. I will fucking cap this motherfucker if you don't tell me where the murderer is. Please put the gun down. Don't tell her. I can deflect a bullet. I have a clear shot. I will kill this motherfucker if you don't tell me where he is. Let her shoot! I can take it! Three! Come on! Two! His name is Brayden. Somewhat trusty weatherman Brayden. 
Where is he? At his, at his house. Can you airdrop me the address? Thank you. What is wrong with you? She's gonna kill him. You know that, right? She was gonna kill you, Skip. I could have handled it. She's right. He had to pay for what he did. Really? Skip, this isn't my fight. If you want to handle Jane, that's on you. You big, dumb, idiot man! What about me? You gave me a second chance. I kidnapped you for like two weeks and you stuck with me. I stole your umbrella like twice and you're still here for me. I'm sorry, Skip, but that's, that's not me. I'm, I'm tired and I, I'm, a, I'm a nobody. Brayden was your friend, more than I was. And even though he's literally never done anything for me, I'm gonna try to save him. Because I know that's the right thing to do. Ten years. Ten years ago today, I took your life. If I could control this body, I'd pop champagne for you. Somewhat trusty weatherman, Brayden. Oh, hi. How in the world am I gonna tell this person I can't move or talk? How does she know my name? I've been waiting for this moment for 10 years. What? All my life trying to avenge my father. It's euphoric knowing how close I am. Oh my God, stupid body, run, run! I just want you to know. This is personal. Ah! Goodbye, weatherman. Stop. You know what this thing can do. Skip, this isn't your business. It is my business. I'm the reason Brayden was able to touch the umbrella in the first place. It wasn't your fault, Skip. It was his fault, and he needs to pay. If you pull your trigger, I'm pulling mine. For if my name isn't J. Bo Barnes the Fourth, I will avenge my father. No, I'm Skip McCloudy. Ah! Oh my God, so much stuff is happening right now. Please God, please let me control my body. Just now, only one. Hello? Trusty weatherman Lucas. X weather. No. You are and always will be a trusty weatherman. But I'm not. I can't use my powers anymore. It doesn't matter. How could it possibly not matter? I'm a nobody now. I'm not a good person. I let Jane leave to kill Brayden. Maybe. But you gave Skip a second chance. And look at him now. That was when I had the umbrella. Do you not remember what I said to you all those years ago? The umbrellas have no power. They only have power if you believe in them. Skip believes in them. You just have to believe that you are special. Everyone is.
Thank you, Councilman. How did you get in my house? Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm a ghost. Like, the whole time, or...? Oh, no, no, no. I got hit by an ice cream truck, like, a couple days ago. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry about that. Oh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, okay, well, how, how do I get there? They're probably already with Brayden. You're the part of your imagination. Just imagine that you're there. Imagine I'm there. Imagine I'm there. Give up, Skip! You know how this is going to end! Never! Come on, come on, come on. Almost there. Come on, almost there. Keep going. Skip! Never! I'm coming for you, Umbrella! Sorry, Skip. How? I am the trusty weatherman. Lucas, I had it all under control. Of course you did. <laughs> Sorry for not coming earlier. No problem, man. You idiots are defending a murderer! Yes! Oh, shit. No! Brayden, give us the umbrella. Why? Last time you had it, you lost control. We have to be safe. I didn't lose control, Lucas. I've always wanted this! I've been watching you from here. It's pretty, ain't it? Brayden has the umbrella. I need to get back. Okay. It's okay. What do you mean it's okay? I wanted to talk to you. You need to learn to forgive. Brayden, he's a, a hair in the butter. What do you mean? It's like a tumbleweed in the far west. Your umbrella's a lot stronger than I thought it would be. <laughs> I know what I have to do. Distract him as much as possible. I trust you. Come here. <laughs> I knew it! I always knew I was better, Lucas. Jane Bowl Barnes, Jr. the fourth. You don't need to live up to your name. Don't make the mistakes I did. Let it go. But he killed you. He's a felon and he just gets to go off scot-free? Sometimes you gotta bite the hay. It wasn't Brayden that killed me. It's the umbrella that done it. And Lucas destroyed that umbrella. Just give Brayden a second chance. That's 
Skip did to me, like they'll do to you. If you just stop. I've gotta take a little time. Any last words, Lucas? You'll always be the somewhat trusty weatherman. I better read between the lines in case I need it when I'm older. I don't think I can do that. I know you can. You can be better. I'll try. For you. I forgive you. You forgive me? Yes. <laughs> I'm not sorry. Goodbye, Brayden. Thanks, I guess. Yeah. Welcome. Why did you forgive him anyways? I guess. I guess it's what Billy would have always wanted. Thank you, Skip. I, I know that wasn't easy. She, she was the best of me. I know. I know. I know. I owe you, Skip. <laughs>